Hello, 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 Focus Creators, and welcome back. So today, 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 we are doing something with this vinyl. What you say? You wanted to know what it did? Ah, look at that. <laughs> All right, y'all. Let me cut my light. One of my lights back on. Because we... Wait. Oh. Okay. Pause. Is that not like super exciting? It's super exciting. So I've probably had this glow in the dark vinyl, like most things in this room that's packed full of stuff for a while. Um, and decided that I was going to pull it out and use it today. Um I had been looking at my numbers on my different social medias and I decided to make this shirt and I was like, well, let me try it with, um, you know, the, with the saying, you know, this class, not small beginnings. Cause I want to remember every step of the way, um, that got me to where I'm going. Um, and so thus the despise, not small beginnings, um, you know, because this is just, this is this is just one stop along the way. If you don't know, I'm right around. I'm over twenty two thousand followers on YouTube, which is where you're watching me now. I also have an Instagram account, a little under five hundred. I just started a TikTok account not very long ago, and I just hit the one hundred mark. And, you know, those numbers may be really small to somebody else, but they mean a whole lot to me because just having five people that I don't know follow me and want to hear what I have to say is um, is something that I appreciate completely. So I've done a lot of talking, but I want you guys to know that I appreciate you and I thank you for watching. So please like and subscribe if you have not um, hit the notification bell. And with that, we're going to get going with this quick, quick project. My talking is probably going to be longer than this video. So today we're going to use some of this glow-in-the-dark vinyl on a bag that if I had children that were small, which I do not. And even when I did, they didn't go trick-or-treating. But for a kid that may go trick-or-treating, um, we're going to do a bag that says we're here for the treats. So I am going to go ahead and weed. I'll just move the camera down here possibly we're going to weed and i'm sorry for what that did for somebody's equilibrium me doing that but um i'm gonna go ahead and weed this so like i said this design is actually in cricut design space um to iron it on, you just want to put it to the size that you want. Um, then you're going to um, mirror it if you're ironing it on. And from there, you're going to weed it like I'm doing right now. Okay, um, I want to make this video super quick. So um, here is the design again i'm here for the treats again i'm using a like a 12 and a half by 12 and a half little canvas bag while my um press is still warming up and so i'm gonna knock some of the wrinkles out of it and also you know prepare it to be able to take this vinyl um so once i do that I'm kind of eyeball it and center it with my eyeballs. I guess there's no other way, right? Uh, so if I want it to be like super technical, I could fold the bag in half. Let's just do it the right way. I can fold the bag in half, put a little crease in it, same way you would do a t-shirt, right? And then you have that little line to kind of be your guide. You do this on a bigger heat press too. I have a bigger one out in my garage. Um, so then you would also take the design and also fold that in half, not on the vinyl, but 
just on where the transfer paper is and that will help you know where the center is so you put the center of the crease that's on your design to the center on the crease that you earned into and at least you know it's straight if you do that right unless you don't care about it being straight um so you know then you just do like that i put this on 350 um i'm gonna do it for 30 seconds you probably half of that is all you need um but Mm -mm -mm. I still have one of the, I've had my Cricut for a while, so, you know, I don't have the latest bigger one. Um, and one day I was going to get that, and then I got the heat press, heat press, the like I said, the bigger one that has the, that clamps down. So I never did go by and um, do that. Um, so here made y'all wait a whole 30 seconds what in the world it, okay <laughs> this is the first time this has happened the transfer paper is still on the, my plate of my thing okay so i guess if you let it sit too long that's a possibility because really like i said about half of the seconds would have did that so um uh that is that like look you know, a whole less than five minutes and we got a cute little bag for the kid to go trick-or-treating or go to their harvest fest at the church, whatever it is that they may do. Um, and that is that. So I am going to cut the lights off. I'm going to let it charge a little bit, get a little light to it. And then I'm going to cut the lights off so you can see it. And But that's going to be it because um, I can't take a picture of it with it. Uh, I don't guess we can try. But anyways, I am rambling. Let me come back up here. So um, thank you, thank you, thank you. Just get my little thank you out the way. Uh, I'm sorry, y'all. I'm looking kind of rough, but I'm trying to get these videos out. And I'm rambling. So let's do this. So as I said earlier, procrastinators, I truly appreciate you. I thank you for watching. I thank you for doing this exciting, like this exciting. Um, and I will say that the glow in the dark vinyl is a sizer product. Um, so I will put this along with canvas bags, all of that in the description box below so that you can just go to Amazon and purchase those items. Um, if you have any questions, as always, please, please, please leave a comment. Um, again, like, subscribe, and hit that bell, and I'll see you all the next time. Ah, so cute! <laughs> I'm so excited. <laughs> Y'all have a good one. Bye!